Hello everyone and welcome back to Stephen DeMau Play Gears of War. My name is Stephen George. I play video games. Sometimes it's Gears of War. Sometimes it's with my wife. When I last left off, we shot the Berserker. Shot Actually, Berserker. we didn't really shoot the Berserker. She just fell off the train. Uh, today we're going to be beating the game. No joke. Beating the game. Oh good, I picked up six bullets. That was a good use of that pack. Here they come, Stephen. We're going to work our way towards the front of the train and uh, beat the game. Because that's how you beat the game, is get to the front of the train. Also, the nemesis are bad, and they're shooting us. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Right behind you, Dom. Love you, Dom. Doing well, doing well. Oh, fart and torque bow. Yeah, I saw that. Blowing up. We're good. <laughs> Shut up, you little crap. Yeah. Oh. Oh no. He got me. Oh no. He he got me. I'm sorry. Do yeah. over. Okay. Okay. Now we're good. Now we've defeated the enemies. Just like the Who, There's we will not get fooled again. Door open. Checkpoint. Go. There's a ladder. Get up there. Press X to use ladder. I'm so bulky. Get to the chopper. There, now I can hit X. All right, get on the chain guns. Striker time. Taking them out. All right, you get that side of the train. I'll get this side. Yeah, that's right. Explode, you piece of crap. Uh, die. My high score is three. You climb the ladder first. <laughs> Oh, I'm going up to four. Four. I got two. Oh, here they come again. Yeah, take that. I'm taking damage. Die. How you doing over there? Oh, this part's easy. Oh, jeez. Is this the boss? This is not the boss. Oh. Ugh. We killed the Reavers. Go where? <laughs> McDonald's to celebrate. Celebration. Friggin' wretches. Oh god. Oh goody. All right. Now the wretches are trying to kill us. Oh, they're the glowing ones, so watch out. They explode. Oh, man. And we don't have shotguns, but we're going to need the torque bows for the boss. Hiss. Die. I was going to call him a wretch, and then I realized that's his name anyway. Like, you little wretch. I oh, didn't God. think wretches were that smart. They're apparently intelligent. Who, who would have guessed? Yeah. This is not the way. Following you. There is. You left one in the corner for me to deal with. Right behind you. Big guy, guy, big guy, oh, big guy. Man. Don't let him chainsaw you. Help me, help me. One's on you. Not on you, but like on you. <laughs> one of the wretches is on you. <laughs> She's turned into a wretch. <laughs> it's a story element. Here we go. Door open. This must not be the right way. Then why did it make us come in here? I don't know. Maybe it didn't make us come in here. Maybe there's an another way we can go. Yeah, we can. We can go on the outside of the car. Button press. Oh, God. More Reavers. Shoot the Reavers. Die, Reaver, die. All right. Killed him. And a oh, jam a gun. Jam gun I did. Oh, this. Here it comes. There we go. Keep moving. Ow. Another one. Oh, he fell off. Aww. Poor little guy. It's a terrible way to go. I am lacking ammo, hardcore. Really, oh wretches. There was a shotgun, I'm still gonna pass it up. Wretch, jump through the windows. Are there more? Oh, yeah. Not behind us, but in front of us, yes. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Oh man. Where are they at? Like, really, where are they're they? They're on the roof. No, they're in the car. 
No, they're not. They're just screaming and they're breaking the windows, but there's none actually in here. Yeah, no, there's, there's one. one. Right here. See it. You got it? Help. Move away from it. It's going to blow up. Oh. Ow. Oh, God. Have we hit the button yet? No. Oh, man. We haven't even initiated the Jack Rip the Door sequence. Hey, this ammo keeps uh, refilling, so refill your ammo if you need to. Come on, Jack, rip the door. On the roof. Wait, what am I looking at? Oh, is it just letting me know that's where they're coming from? I don't, I don't care where they're coming from. I just want them dead. Oh God, die! Little piece of crap. Oh God, crap, die! Infinite ammo. Oh, gone at door. Why aren't you open? Jack is taking his dear sweet time with that door. Friggin' wretches. Ow. Checkpoint. Yeah. Well, if Jack would open the door. Door's open. Coming. All right, try to fight your way forward. We don't got a lot, a lot of time. They're just wretches. Running forward. We kept the train from stopping. Somehow. We ditched the uh, we ditched the train. The train's gone. Woo! We're approaching target. I did that too. <laughs> Let's go. We're almost there. Cool. Open door. Now it works. The door is magical. Get out of my way, big thing. Three big, four big things. Whew. Almost there. Almost I wonder if there. We can fall off the train. Um, it's something I would not not try. try. Oh. All right. What's in here? All right. Here's all the stuff that we may want. Because we are at the boss battle. What's this? That's oh. a sniper. Nice. Just uh, fill up on grenades. Make sure you've got full ammo for all your other crap. And a torque bow is useful. You ready for this? Oh, okay, remember the torque bow, you have that. to hold down the trigger to charge it up. It's yeah. not something you just press. Door open! Let's do this. Off the side of the train? <laughs> right here. General Ram. Maybe Rom, I don't know. However you want to pronounce it. R W A M. Now Rom has brought with him a fleet of Krill. And also a chopper. That's our chopper. Yeah, that's right. What we have to do is we have to um, cause an explosion on Ram to get the Krill to leave. That's why we have the torque bows. And then he will be vulnerable. Until that point, he is invulnerable. So take cover and get out your torque bow. Now the, it'll blow up and the krill will leave, making him vulnerable. Shoot him. And then the krill come back. And reload. And sh I think I missed that one. Keep, keep at it. Confused. Basically, keep shooting him with the torque bow, and this will be over real quick. Man. Oh, I thought that was us. Nope. <laughs> Whenever, like, if you have two people just pounding him with the torque bow, he goes down quick. He goes down really quick, and there we go. The power of the torque bow. Bada bing, bada boom. Shoes. <laughs> it's a big shoes. Uh huh. There's a, there's actually a Nike outlet on Sarah. Okay. That's, that's where he shops. And they, they just nodded at each other because they're like, man, those are big boots. And he's like, yeah, those are big boots. See, now the general's going to be mad. He's like, didn't you grab his boots? They had to kill so many animals to make them boots. I don't think Nike is made of leather. I don't think it's <laughs> a leather Nike. Well, maybe the golf shoes. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know anything about shoes. I just know about thine extra guns, son. Mm -hmm. Here we go. 
We're deploying the light mass bomb. So now we are speeding the bomb. And now the game becomes a side scroller. <laughs> what you gonna do, Marcus? You don't got long. You gonna send that bomb right into the tunnel? Come on, Marcus. You need that chopper, or there'll never be a Gears of War 2 or 3. Mm -hmm. It's like, well, a sequel would be nice. Sequel? Sequel? Yeah, I don't know. Do I want one? Do I? Okay, fine. I, I want a sequel. I'm going for it. I don't think the helicopter also, could fly that way. That's a really skilled pilot. Uh huh. Like, insane. Why did he need to stay on it? Like,. Because the chopper wasn't close enough. And to, no, it seemed and like he was debating. <laughs> he was trying to figure out if he wanted a sequel or not. It's a big deal. He's like, I don't know if I want a sequel. Gears of War, a game about destroying trains. So now that it's uh, down there, it's going to navigate the tunnels because it knows how to navigate the tunnels and because we got the information from Marcus's father's house. Well, today is just a lovely day in the neighborhood. What's, it, what's that sound? Oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, corpse sir. No! You're all dead. Dang. I don't know if I could hold on to Marcus. He's pretty bulky. They all probably weigh like 400 pounds. And... The general vaguely looks like Nintendo Capri Sun. Sort of. A little bit. He looks a little bit like Tim, in my opinion. People may or may not agree with me. I don't know. It's just a certain angle. <laughs> anyway, let's get out of here. So, what are we doing tomorrow? McDonald's. Gears of War 2. <laughs> yeah, Gears of War 2. Your gears successfully deployed the light mass bomb. We have destroyed the enemy stronghold. But that's classified. Our brown, brown world. Yup. They do not understand. That's the queen talking. They do not know why we wage this war. Um, because you want the planet? Why we cannot stop. Because you want the planet? They're actually they were actually here first. Stop. Yeah. To be fair. Why we will fight and fight and fight. Until we win. Why will they do that? Well, yeah, that's kind of how and it works. AKA Gears of War 2. To be fair, I've never played Gears of War 2, so I don't know why they're fighting it. Who knows? Because I, I really do not know. We'll find out one day. Mm. Uh, Gears of War's got some of the coolest credits because they show pictures, which more people should do so you feel connected with the developers of the game. It also plays some pretty sick, awesome music. This is, well, this is equally sick, awesome. <laughs> also, <laughs> I'm never using that phrase again, sick, awesome. Uh, but after this is after this music is done, it, it plays some more sick, awesome music. Coltrane sings, which is fantastic. Uh -huh. um, but yeah, Gears of War, done. Uh, much shorter than I remember. Mm -hmm. I'm going to be very honest. I thought this was going to be a longer LP, but it wasn't. Um, people are going to want to know, are we going to be doing the sequels? There's a high possibility. Um, pretty much what, what we've been doing recently is we've been doing the first games in series. And if it goes well, we'll continue them. For example, uh, doing Uncharted. Uh, Uncharted just went pretty well, so I've pretty much decided that we're going to be doing Uncharted 2. Same thing with Gears of War. We do Gears of War 1, and depending on you know if people respond to it well, we'll do Gears of War 2. <laughs> Sorry, the song is so good. <laughs> it's 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 very fantastic. Um, oh god, I'm not gonna be able to talk over this. Okay, um, thank you guys for watching. We sincerely appreciate your support. Um, if you guys have uh, ideas for <laughs> for future LPs, 
be sure to leave them below. We always take them uh, into consideration. No guarantees, but we do look at the list. We, we look at what you guys want to see, and we do take it into consideration. Uh, with all that being said, thank you for joining us, and be sure to join us on our next LP. I don't even know what that is yet, actually. Huh? Who's the... Boy? Yeah, you guys will have to read this stuff. That's another reason we'll leave you alone. So thanks for watching. We'll see you guys for the next LP. We're going to let the uh, credits run its course so you can read this stuff and listen to the amazing song. We will see you guys later. Back in the game. just kind of cuts back to this. Oh, you guys are still here. Huh. Well, go home. You're probably at home. So, watch. Go outside and play. <laughs> no, no. Don't go outside and play. Watch more videos, but only videos that I make. <laughs> it's the rules. And also have some juice. White grape juice is really good. It's on my shopping list right now. You're still not leaving. You're still here. All right, bye. <sighs> Good job, kid. Game done.